Belarusians have voted in a constitutional referendum, allowing the former Soviet Republic to host nuclear weapons. The constitutional reforms also extend the rule of leader Alexander Lukashenko. The amendments would reinstate presidential term limits to two five-year terms, but that will only apply to the next elected president. If Lukashenko contests the election in 2025, he could remain in power for an additional 10 years. It would also give lifetime immunity to the president from prosecution once he left office. The vote took place against the back ground of a sweeping crackdown on domestic opponents of the government. The West has already said it won't recognize the results of the referendum, which was held while neighboring Ukraine is under attack from Russian troops. Belarus acted as a launch pad for some of those Russian troops invading Ukraine. The new constitution could also see the return of nuclear weapons on Belarusian soil. Belarus gave them up after the fall of the Soviet Union. But the revised law sheds Belarus's neutral status and could open the way for stronger military cooperation with Russia.